Yeah, good morning students. So, the next problem which is from week 2, second problem. Construct an ellipse when its major axis is equal to 100 mm and minor axis is equal to 65 mm. Use rectangle method. Actually, the similar problem we could find in the our textbook. Uh, so, let us draw this problem. So, you have to make two axis line to direct of uh, this example. So, let me draw one long dashed dotted line especially for the axis. They are given the two sides one is a major and another one is minus the major is 100 mm and minor is 50 65 mm. So, let us draw this is a rectangle method. Similarly, there was we have seen previously that it is a concentric circle method we just draw two numbers of circle. Here the rectangle method we just going to draw one rectangle with reference of these two lines. Okay. So, let us make one uh, let us fix the height total height of 65 mm uh, 65 divided by 2 is 32 I am fixing at the center here 1 here I think 2 so these two points let us mark similarly here 100 I kept in the 50 so properly do with your compass ok so extend this line to draw a rectangle it is supposed to be parallel to the minor axis and extending this line is parallel to the axis similarly yeah now I could see the rectangle to make the ellipse inside the rectangle. Now let us name the point at the center is O and this is P let us start from here P Q R yes similarly other one A B C D a is the edges for uh, major axis and B D is edges for the B and D it is edges for the minor axis actually A B C D ok A C is a uh, edges. So, here with this diagram what we need to do this is totally 110 mm you show the dimension which is 110 and this one is 65 I am using oblique strokes that is your choice and we are supposed to draw inside the ellipse so the ellipse touches A D C B you make overview in your mind now we have to divide in a equal part of this segment and this segment this segment this segment obviously this segment and this segment for example this is 25 mm I could divide in a four numbers of equal parts 25 divided by 4 how much it may be 25 and divided by or almost 2.5 or 6 is very minimal ok let me take I just divided in a 4 equal parts 2, 3 and obviously 4. Similarly in this direction 1, 2, 3 and 4, 4 division and 3 point 1, 2, 3 similarly here 1, 2, 3. 
similarly o to a and o to c so that is 50 mm divided by 4 is 12 basically 1 centimeter 1.1 12 mm maybe so i measured 12 mm 1 2 3 this direction 1 2 3 now we just name here it is from a it is 1 dash 2 dash 3 dash here 1 2 3 similarly 1 2 3 1 dash 2 dash 3 dash obviously here 3 2 1 you just add suffix 1 3 1 2 1 1 1 like 3 1 2 1 1 1 so the division is taking some important part to draw an ellipse with a rectangle method now what we need to do we supposed to connect from the edges of minor b to all the points which is we have marked in this particular portion of the rectangle for example i make i am just connecting 1 to b 2 to b 3 to b obviously 1 dash to d 2 dash to d 3 dash to d and b to this side 1 and 2 and 3 similarly down sides So, I just divide it and this is connected with the minor axis towards the edges of major axis. Again, similarly, from C, sorry, from B and D, I am just going to make the line which is pass with 3, 1. So, if I drop a line from B, 3, 1, and it has to touch 3 dash, the D to 3 dash line. So, that the point to be considered for the path of ellipse. Similar manner, I'm just going to draw this is a point i just made a first point that could be considered p3 since it is dash p3 dash similarly you have to pass a line with from b to crossing 2 1 and and 2 dash 2 dash line so this is a point it is can be considered it's a p2 dash similarly P1 dash. Similar manner from D. So, this is a standard way to connect to give the numbering and all P3, P2, sorry. Another other hand one two if you not comfortable with the dropping a line you just directly point out the points that is okay yes see it is in same line I am just marking the point alone that is also good so I am writing here P3 P2 P1 P1 dash P2 dash P3 dash similarly P2 P1 now I got all the point P1 P2 P3 similarly P1 dash P2 dash P3 dash so these are all the path that we already traced to drop a ellipse so you connect these path by a smooth curve 
by a smooth curve. If you are reducing the division, your accuracy will be very less. So, one by one, you have to finish. That's it. Now, you can darken it. You must use the thin pencil instead of the HP pencil. Just make in your mind. That's it. Thanks.